It's mind-bending science. What does matter do exactly to this space-time? With the help of a space-time simulator, these Year 7 Mount Lawley Senior High School students are learning Einsteinian physics. We've been learning about how space-time tells matter how to move and matter tells space-time how to curve. And while generally not taught till university, those involved in the Einstein First project hope that will soon change. Every kid has the right to share the best understanding of the universe. So we are, we are developing some hands-on activities to teach the concepts of general relativity, special relativity and quantum physics. The current science curriculum in schools relies heavily on Isaac Newton's discoveries around gravity and the laws governing motion, discoveries Albert Einstein later proved problematic. Being able to explain Newton's ideas in terms now of Einsteinian physics, I just think is, is what we need to be doing. While the project hopes to ultimately shake up how and what science is taught in schools, it's also uncovered another upside. In our all the programs, we found that, like girls are responded very well. So they are like uh, there's significant improvement in their attitude towards science, and there's a significant improvements in their conceptual understanding. You're seeing more girls involved in it, and the girls themselves are talking about it. It's been a steep learning curve for the school teachers, but is so far proving positive for all involved. What I found most exciting about all of this is having these physics type discussions with the teachers and I found it to be extremely profound for physicists. The Einstein First project was last year awarded Australian Research Council funding and is trialling the program for students from year three to year ten. Brianna Shepherd, ABC News.